the Ministry of Information and Technology together with NITAM have launched a data and privacy portal which will help in keeping personal information for Ugandans as privacy. Now the launch was officiated by the State Minister for ICT, Honorable Joyce Sebugwao at Uganda Media Center in Kampala. As Uganda joins the rest of the world to celebrate the World Data Privacy Day, a day which is celebrated every 31st of May, the government of Uganda, together with NITA U, have launched a system dubbed the Data Protection and Privacy Portal. This is aimed at ensuring that people's personal information, such as names, date of birth, places of residence, and much more, is secure in line with the 2019 Personal Data Protection Act. Speaking to the media during the launch, Joyce Sebuguao, the State Minister for ICT, called upon all organizations that process data in the country to comply with the act. Data protection and privacy takes center stage because personal data needs to be protected and privacy rights need to be upheld. I call upon organizations, personal and collect and process. The minister further said that the Minister of ICT is committed to enacting the Personal Protection Data Act and supporting the Personal Data Protection Office to have this innovation successful. The Minister through the office will vigorously enforce the Data Protection and Privacy Act and its attendant regulations. We are committed to this cause and we shall support the Personal Data Protection Office and INITA Uganda in delivering on this mandate. On the other hand, the Executive Director for NITA Uganda highlighted some of the benefits of this portal and the type of data that would be compiled using the portal. My name, uh, my passport number, it could even be different data as long as when it's put together it identifies me as a, as a person. Data relating to companies, uh, trade secrets is not under this law. Uh, if you have data that you're utilizing and you've anonymized it, in other words, no one can tell who these individuals are. Uh, if it is in a computer system, it is just a number zero and one then that will not be personal data. The Permanent Secretary for the Ministry of ICT called upon institutions in the country to register with the portal to ensure that the privacy of their employees and clients is secure. Recently, we signed a circular requiring all accounting officers of government NDS to comply with the law, starting with registering their respective entities with the Data Protection Office. I think to date we have from Nikop as the national uh, personal data protection manager said, companies or government agencies that have needed to this and registered themselves under this entity. For a long time, many Ugandans, including government officials, have complained about cyberbullying, forcing the government to introduce the Cyber Act with an intent of mitigating the vice. Now, with the introduction of the Personal Data Protection and Privacy Portal, individuals will be much secure as access to their information requires their consent.